Leo. Tror jag stod jag på er. Okay, I see you. How did you get here? Niyazi, niyazi. Karibu nito again to yet another episode of Random Thoughts. Hapa tuna get curious ama. Leo nataka kuongelea story ya oil. Ever since ever tumekuwa tukiambiwa oil, coal, natural gas zinakuwa ga part of fossil fuels. Na fossil fuels tulikuwa tunafundishwa ni organic materials ama organic remains from prehistoric times zinye zili die alafu with time zikafunikwa na mchanga alafu with time due to weight of overlying mass zika create pressure na heat yenye ndio form oil tukiangalia na hiyo perspective inatupatia ideology ya oil ni a finite resource yani within no time kuna venye itakatika itaisha lakini mpaka sasa hii oh no no bado oil ni nyingi ama <laughs> sasa kuna company ya standard oil ili form in 1870 by John D Rockefeller at that time was the biggest oil refinery in the world oil kuna fanya oil production uh, refinery transportation marketing Uh, of oil. Aundo alikuwa responsible to coin the term fossil fuel. Idea behind it walikuwa nataka to make it feel as though oil ni rare. Ndio a driver price ya oil they make it quite expensive due it's a finite resource. So in 1911 Supreme Court ya US linalifa hiyo company stating that standard oil is an illegal monopoly. Gee, I wonder why sande kuna element ya inaitwa pico. Atipika ngoa. <laughs> pico. <laughs> Sa pico linamaanisha predictions of a point in time when uh, oil, oil production itafika maximum. After that kutakuwa na decline in oil production meaning price ya oil itaenda juu because of element ya scarcity mpaka ile time oil itaisha kabisa. Sa in 1977 walikuwa me predict ati <laughs> ati In the next 40 years from 1977 oil itakuimisha kabisa. Yaani hakutakuwa na oil kabisa. Sasa hiyo zilikuwa inafika 2017. Si naona bado tuko na oil. Sasa kitu ilikuwa ina mess ni walikuwa na kila time wakimeka prediction ikifika hiyo time lazima wa postpone. Ya kwanza ilikuwa 26. Ya kwanza ya ikafuatiliwa na 2013. 2013 kufika akaona. <laughs> 20 2030 2020 kufika wakai postpone tena mpaka 2040 sasa unajua kitu fani ni vile at first we like we predict at 2017 oil itakuwa imeisha kabisa kitu fani ile hapa in 2018 ilifika ili mark the highest ever recorded oil production in history in 2018 oil production ilikuwa at 1.213 million barrels per day of which it was 70% higher than the highest ever recorded oil production in history of which it was 1970 sasa hii kitu ni scars kweli sasa geologists ni wanajaribu ku explain this scenario ona sema at at times uh, some oil reserves after zimeshakuwa depleted wakitoka hapo wakirudi maybe after some time wanapata ime regenerate yeah. Oil, oil levels zina zimepanda tena alafu sasa wanazi wana harvest wana harvest tena other reports na claim uh, technology ya kitambo haingeza ku manage ku harvest all the oil from reserves kulikuwa na technique inaitwa fracking method yenye ili manage ili kuna manage to ku harvest like 5% from most oil reserves lakini sasa hii kuna kwa kicombine technology into fracking hiyo ni all na ingine ni to horizontal drilling of which in a manage only to have is like 15% to calculate 15 na 5 ni only 20% ina maanisha kuna 80% of untapped oil yenye bado haijavestiwa based on your report ya wa geologists <laughs> so up to that bado mnaona ni kama 
oil ni rare ama ni fossil fuel alafu tunaweza jiuliza swali moja after all these facts mbona bado oil ni expensive ama price yake bado ishuki yeah. ama tunaweza jiuliza kitu kingine kazi ya oil ni nini ama ina purpose gani so kinuliza mimi na believe oil has two main purposes one mechanical na pili physiological or something tukiangalia mechanical tunaambia from geography planets rely on movable plates zinaitwa tectonic plates lakini alafu kitu fani ni pale hizo tectonic plates zina converge hiyo area hizo areas zina kuangana abundance of oil tukichukua hii map ngali area kwanza pale tectonic plates zime converge na tena area pili pale tectonic plates zime converge eh? ukichukua hizo spots alafu tu transfer kwa map uta realize na apia pale Venezuela iko na pale Middle East iko of which are the highest producers of oil tukipanda juu kiasi tuende North America unaangalia pale tectonic plate iko ina lie across pale Canada iko na US na Canada inakuaga among the highest producers of oil so unaona ina make sense i believe function of oil ni ku bring about lubrication ya tectonic plates ku facilitate villages na move twende kwa physiological hapa na tajiri to change perspective kidogo to switch perspective kidogo tu sana nataka tuangalie earth kama physiological being ama organic being kama tu plants and animals ukiangalia sasa hii tunaweza extract oils from vegetables tutengeneze vegetable oils zenye tunatumia kupika ukiangalia kitambo tulikuwa tunatumia animal oils ama animal fat kupika lakini liko deemed and healthy because of cholesterol kitambo before uh, oil liko discovered Europeans walikuwa na hunt whales process liko inaitwa whaling wana hunt whales alafu na extract oils from whales yenye wanatumia ku light lamps na kutengeneza soap because at that time oil liko ni kwa discovered sasa unaona sasa tukiangalia hata situation yetu kitu yote tutakula by product yenye itatoka itakuwa na capacity ya kugenerate energy in the form of biogas ama natural gas. Sasa tuchukue hiyo perspective tuilete kwa earth. Tukiangalia kitu kinaitwa carbon cycle. Na vile animals na release carbon dioxide, plant na take you carbon dioxide, alafu eventually zikidai, vile earth ita digest hiyo organic matter, eventually form fossil fuel as we are told. Hapo ndo realize hakuna vile anything that is dead in the spot a live and vibrant ecosystem you can get plants that derive life from earth book of genesis that on the from dust became dust we shall return in our support element your life cycle your life through earth so by that i believe oil ni by product your earth physiological process yeah sandu tukijiliza mbona bado value oil bado iko juu it's political Julie time itakuwa made public at value of oil civil tuna perceive value of dollar itashuka because hiyo ndio the main currency yenye inatumika ku buy and sell oil worldwide the petrol dollar so i hope mona why oil haizi kwa fossil fuel there haizi kwa fossil fuel <laughs> to check any next time and um,